I did it guys, I sold my Hector Dow. Welcome back to 8 to Free. My name is Aaron, the channel all about side hustles and passive income till we're able to achieve financial freedom. If you are new here, make sure you smash the like button, subscribe to my channel down below, turn on the bell notification so you don't miss any future videos, and then comment down below if you have Hector Dow in your portfolio. So I originally invested in Hector Dow back in November of last year. So I've been in Hector Dow for about six months now. Back in November of last year, I put in $190 in hopes that it would grow to something that I was seeing other people achieve on YouTube, Twitter, Discord, etc. So back when I put $190 in, the APY of Hector Dow was I think 350,000%. Now, one thing to know, and I knew this going in that these protocols are extremely risky so the likelihood that that's sustainable long term is very very small. Since I've been invested I watched the price of Hector Dow go from $196 which was my original entry point all the way down to where it is today at just over $20. So during that time that I was invested I obviously was earning rewards However, on my original $190, it is only worth about $31. So I lost a total of about 84% of my original investment into Hector Dow. Now the cool thing about these platforms is you do earn rewards. So over the time that I've been holding and staking Hector Dow, I have earned back about 3.5 Hector Dow for a total reward of about $83, making my overall loss about $78 overall. So what I sold just the other day, you'll see the video of me doing it here. It was a little sad, kind of hit me in the heart a little bit because this was something I was really hoping would be sustainable long term and to help me grow my overall net worth in my portfolio. I lost a total of $80, so that means I was able to pull out about $110. I will say of all the staking platforms I have, this one was not my biggest loss by a long shot. I would gladly take uh, you know, an overall like 40% loss on my money for these specific platforms that I've been staking in because there are other platforms platforms that I put money in that are worse off than this. So some of you might be asking, why am I getting rid of my Hector Dow? Well, like I said earlier, the APY of Hector Dow has gone from 350,000% all the way down to less than 200% to where it is today. The time for me to pull out my money has come. So as of right now, I just don't feel it's a good spot for me to hold that money. So I'm pulling it out and I'm going to be putting it into a different project, into the stock market. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do with it. It came time for me to just cut my loss at about 41%. So if you guys are still hanging on to Hector Dow, let me know down below. I would love to know your thoughts on it. Did I make the wrong move by pulling my money out? Should I have sold a long time ago? Yeah, probably. But again, I do this for you guys to provide transparency, make sure that we're all in the loop of a YouTuber that has a little bit of skin in the game versus some that put in thousands and thousands of dollars, earn a bunch, and then pull out their money after their video goes viral. So one thing, I want to ask you guys is do you think there's a maximum time that you should hold money in any of these staking platforms? I'm starting to find that the DeFi space like holding your money in any platform for like longer than 60 days is really really risky. I've seen like a lot of these projects really do well right off the bat and then after like that 60 day period they all of a sudden start to go down. It's happened several times with my Time Wonderland, my Hector Dow, my Templar Dow, my Olympus Dow, Dow, my life Dow, etc. So it, it's not the first time that this has happened. It's just something I want to ask you guys. Do you think there's like a max longevity that you should be holding your money in any of these staking or DeFi programs? My personal opinion, I think it's about that 60 day mark. Like I said, it just seems to be the sweet spot. And also I do think people that put a lot more money in are the ones that are reaping more rewards than the little guys like we are uh, for obvious reasons reasons, but I think they're keeping their money in it for only 30, 60 days, pulling out the money, and they're the ones taking profits. Whereas a small, small guy like me, I'm just putting a little bit in and my little bit will fluctuate pretty substantially as those bigger investors buy and sell that particular 
crypto. So as much as it was sad to see it go, it was time for me to cut ties with Hector Dow. I appreciate you guys being with me on my Hector Dow journey. Unfortunately, it has come to an end and I will no longer be doing updates on my Hector Dow. Now, if this program or platform eventually gets more traction and starts, you know, revamping, which maybe it will possibly, do. I've had a couple people comment on my video saying that they think it's a good long-term platform. Just for me right now, I just don't see it. So I appreciate you guys watching all my videos on Hector Dow. Make sure you're still watching my other videos on some other platforms that I'm in. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, like this video, go follow me on TikTok and Twitter down below. Comment if I made a bad decision, comment if I made a good decision. Make sure you subscribe, hit the bell notification. I appreciate you guys watching and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.